Hey guys, so I am absolutely sorry for not making any kind of video whatsoever with my nails, makeup, any kind of videos like that whatsoever. Uh, college has been kicking my butt, like, recently, like, a lot, so I haven't been, I haven't had time to make a video or anything like that. Uh, this is actually my first video that I'm going to be making, and hopefully I'm going to be making videos throughout the night, so I can just push them away and, um, have them done for you guys within the weeks that are coming up. But, um, I totally upset because I was supposed to do my favorite video October 1st and I didn't get a chance to because school seriously school is really really getting down to the nitty gritty and um I recommend if you're not in college yet um you will definitely understand what I'm talking about once you uh you know get into like your second year of college and you're really like working hard to get to uh to graduation but I still have a long way to go to graduate, but it's just uh, now I'm starting to get into my major. So, yeah, I'm so sorry, guys. But um, hopefully uh, I will have my break soon, and I will be making videos for you guys throughout the holidays because that's what I tend to do, and I tend to have things for you guys. It's just I haven't had time to make the uh, videos for you guys. But let me just stop talking about this. And you guys want to see my uh, September favorites. And then, during the month of September, um, I really haven't, uh, used any new products. I've been recently just using, like, my old stuff that, like, I had. But, um, I did get a few new things, so, um, it's not a lot at all. It's gonna take at least, like, seven minutes, maybe ten minutes. It's not gonna be that long, but let's just get started. And we're gonna start with things that don't even count as, um, beauty products. Um, this is a candle that is from Bath and Body Works and this is homemade cookies and it's twenty dollars um they usually have a sale during the holidays I think it's like two for twenty or something which you cannot beat because this thing right here is twenty dollars and I only lit it once but it smells like homemade chocolate chip cookies and it smells absolutely amazing and I'm the type of girl who likes baked goods scents like um right now I have one a plug-in from Bath and Body Works and it is it's called Cupcake Frosting and it smells absolutely amazing. It smells like vanilla frosting and you just feel like you have to eat every hour when you walk into my room because it just smells so good. But um definitely gonna be lighting the this these I said these this. Um I usually um light it when like I wanna be relaxed and everything, but it's just I haven't had the time to uh really like relax. So hopefully tonight I will definitely uh, be using this but this is my favorite uh candle one of my favorite another one that i absolutely love which i didn't get this year but i think i showed you guys it's called pumpkin patch and bath and the body works makes it seriously it smells like you're in like a pumpkin patch and it's spicy like it has like a spicy scent to it i kind of like it a lot so um it definitely gets you into like the whole fall mood so um, but yeah, this is one of my favorite, and I usually just keep it on my uh, door, so let me just put it back there. Okay, okay. Now we're going to start with, speaking of Bath and Body Works, let's just go on to this. Um, Bath and Body Works came out with a new scent, October 3rd, which was last Monday. And it is called Charm Life. And the only reason why I knew about this before it even came out is because um, I went on the website and I signed up for like uh, upcoming events and new things like that so um, if you want to know like what scents they're coming out with next um, yeah you get like coupons and everything so of course I took advantage and used my coupons and the day it came out is the day I ran there to see what it smelled like and once, once again I fell in love with it and I had to buy it so just like I bought the whole Into the Wild thing into the wild, they usually, the hell is that, sorry, usually every uh, new thing they come out with, they come out with a cute little kit like this, and it comes with a shower gel, the spray, and the lotion, just a mini one for $10, which is not bad at all, so um, I was so in love with Into the Wild that I got um, this one, and um, the whole uh, Paris Amour, which I'm in love with, it came out last month, um, I didn't have a, they didn't have any of these and they weren't on sale. It was like originally $20, which I thought I can just buy the bigger bottles instead. So, um, I didn't get the whole kit when, it, um, Paris and More came out. But when Charm Light came out, definitely got it. And this is their cute, uh, bag. And you can see it still has a tag on it. 
say it's originally 20, but the day you go, the day the day it comes out is the is when they have like this big sale for like ten dollars. So I ran there and I got it and I fell in love with the bag. I think it's so cute. Um, definitely cute for another makeup bag. And inside, which is the uh, little spray, the uh, shower gel, and the lotion. So these three things come in, these three things and this for $10, which is not bad at all. Um, but yeah, it's so cute inside, it has little polka dots, um, it's basically reversed. Um, but yeah, I definitely fell in love with it. And um, so I got that, and then I also bought the bigger bottle, because I knew I was just, this little one was just wasn't going to work. So I got the bigger bottle. And this is Charm Life. And it smells so good. I'm going to try and describe it. It smells like candy. Now, it smells a little bit like candy. Not really. Like, I'm not a type of girl that likes candy scents. But it smells a little bit like candy. I'm going to spray myself. Okay. This is, this is what I'm going to say. If you ever uh, tried... If you ever tried Paris Amour and you like that scent, like this is kind of like a romantic kind of sweet scent, you're definitely going to love Charm Life. That's, that's all I'm going to say. So if you like Paris Amour, you're definitely going to like Charm Life. So um, it's, it's it's more of a stronger scent than any of the uh, Bath and Body Works, um, like Sweet Pea, uh, Cucumber Melon, like stuff like that. You see how like it wears off? These ones are like perfumes, like it's gonna last you like all day. So these two are definitely my favorite. So like I just like to spray in the morning before I go to college, just and go. So um yeah. So if you like Paris and more, you're definitely gonna like Charm Life. Um just go there and just smell it. And if you like it, and get it. If not, um then don't get it. But um that's that's basically it. that's all I'm gonna say is if you like Paris and more, you're definitely gonna like Charm Life. So um another thing I've been loving is this. And this is called Extreme Shine, and this is for um, anti-frizz treatments, which uh, my hair has been getting a lot of frizzy, I guess because of the, the whole season changing now, um, especially because it's starting to get into the fall and starting to get cold and windy, and my hair is not good with the wind, so, you know, I had to keep, I usually keep this, and I had this for a while, and then I recently found it, and I started using it again, and I really, really like it. The only thing is you have to spray it like really, really far because then it's going to leave your hair looking oily. Um, it also has like an oily uh, sensation too. So um, definitely if you get that or any kind of um, frizz thing, make sure you spray it far away because it's going to make you look like you have to uh, wash your hair badly. So um, another thing that I've been loving is uh, Colgate. And this is uh, Mix Max Fresh with a mini free strip. Breath strips? Breath strips. Why did I say breathe strips? But anyway, um, this is for uh, whitening your teeth. Like mine. <laughs> um, so if you want to know why my teeth are so white, it's because I, first of all, take good care of them. Um, I see a dentist every six months. And, um, yeah, I've been using this. And I also use the, um, mouthwash. So, um, yeah, I definitely... I'm like a freak fanatic when it comes to my teeth. Seriously, when I was little, like, I never really cared. Like, it was always, like, candy in my mouth. But now, like, seriously, I will not go near candy. I don't care if candy doesn't exist anymore. Um, chocolate's a little bit different. But, um, seriously, like, any kind of sweet, sour kind of scent, I really don't care, like, if they, like, be gone that one day and you're like, oh, you know. Do you remember when, you know, you had, like, sweet candy? Yeah, I really don't even care. So, I'm getting off topic. Um, another thing that I've been loving is the e.l.f. And this I had for such a long time. Wait, let me show you. That's how long I had it. Look at that. And I've been recently falling in love with it again. Especially these three colors. As you can see, like, they've been used the most. But seriously, if you really want, like, a smoky eye, these two right here do the trick. Actually, these three in the front do the trick. But um, I really haven't used any of the other ones. Um, I don't know why I should start using them because they're really pretty. But, um, yeah, this is only $5, and you can either get it on the website, or you can actually go to Target, and they should have it. But it's only $5, and it's really, really cute, and it's, uh, very pigmented. 
I love e.l.f. You know that I love e.l.f. And everything that I got from e.l.f., like, I can't say bad about because their pigment tint, their colors, um, you get what your money's worth. Actually, you, you don't because this is only $5, and seriously, you would think it's, like, $25. But uh, if it was $25, I would still buy it because it's really just that good. Um, okay. Another thing I've been loving is NYC. And this is called Smooth Skin Liquid Makeup. And this is in... Oh, it doesn't even tell you. Oh, I think it does. Wait. Soft beige. And you can see this is a little bit light than usually what I usually wear. Um, I think I have to go a, a step higher or a color higher than this one. I think I would just have to get beige, not soft beige. But um, I definitely, love, definitely love it. Um, it's actually one of my favorites, but my number one favorite is, of course, the Elf one. And speaking of NYC, this color I've been loving, and this is um, NYC called Cafe. It's called Cafe, and I'll actually put it on for you guys. As you can see, the difference. It's kind of like a shiny, it's like really, really shiny. It's really like a shiny color. And I absolutely love it. Like, it really makes my lips pop. And it's not that dark, so I kind of like it a lot. It's just, you really have to rub it in. Like that, so. Love that color. And, of course, speaking of NYC one more time. Um, I've been absolutely loving, which is my awesome favorite, as you can see, like, I hit pan. And this is NYC, um, color wheel, and this is in translucent, translucent highlighter glow, so. Definitely been using this a lot. Um, and I've also been using the MAC one. And this is in medium dark. This is absolutely my favorite, but as you can see, it's really, really pretty. And it's MAC. And um, it's, since it's starting to get fall and it's starting to get a little chilly, um, you can definitely pull off rosy cheeks because you can act like you're cold, but you're really not. But um, I've been using this one, and this is the uh, color wheel from NYC. And this is in pink chink. Pink chink. Pink cheek glow. And I can actually show you. Look how pretty it is. And seriously, you can't tell, but it's like so glittery. That's what it is in. And um I also have been loving the e.l.f. powder brush. This is what it looks like. And seriously, it works so good. Like it really gets down into it. And I just absolutely am in love with this thing. So happy I spent, like, what, $5 on this? <laughs> but, yeah, it's absolutely my favorite. Um, and um, since it's becoming fall and you're starting to change your nail polishes into uh, more of a darker color than a bright color, um, I've been absolutely loving this color, which I'm going to paint my nails again. And this is in... I don't even remember... I can't pronounce that. Java. It's Java something. Let me see if you guys can see it. Java something. But, um, this is the color, and it's a really, really, uh, pretty, like, uh, kind of like a hot chocolate, but it's a little bit lighter. Um, it's really pretty for the fall, uh, especially, like, on your nails. Um, on your toenails, I would go a little bit into like a not red but like uh like a burgundy color that would be really pretty so um i that's what the one thing i love when like it comes to like fall and everything like you change like your nail polish set like you put like all your summer ones away and then you bring out your fall ones and like i don't know i just love like dark colors like um fall colors and winter colors like the dark like warm colors i don't know i guess it's like a girl thing um some some girls don't care um, but I want to talk about this real fast. Um, this is the Sally Hansen, and this is called Color Quick Fast Dry, and this is a nail color pen. This is a nail polish and a pen, and this is, um, what color is it? This is Midnight. 
just midnight. And what you do is you just um, you twist it all like that. And then this is the uh, color. And what you do is you push it in two times. And then you just paint your nails. And seriously, I think this is like the best thing ever. Um, I really recommend it to uh, the to my, like my subscribers and whoever else is watching. Definitely recommend this. It's ten dollars for one. Um, I only have two. I have like an orange orange mango color, and I have like this dark blue color. Um, I'm definitely going to be getting more. It's just they're really expensive, but they're definitely worth it. So, um, I just haven't had the time to, um, uh, actually, like, shop, which I'm definitely going to, hopefully tomorrow, because I'm off. But, um, yeah. And speaking of, um, perfumes or whatever, which I was talking about, Bath and Body Works, um, another, uh, what the hell is that? Another, um, perfume that I definitely recommend for the whole, like, fall, winter thing. Um, this can actually go for any season like any winter spring summer or fall because um it's like an all year round kind of scent and this is hollister soap kale and i definitely recommend this um any of my other ones i really highly don't recommend because some of them are like really spring and like summery like the victoria's secret one i have it's shaped as a sunflower and it's like it smells like flowers and stuff so like you really won't want to wear that in like winter unless you really really miss um summer but um i like the whole season change so Okay, and, um, you remember my EOSs, right? Well, I got two new other ones, and these are the ones that I originally had. This is Summer Fruit. This is, uh, I forget your name, Sweet Mint, I think. This is Honeydew. This is Lemon, and then this is Tangerine Medicated one. And the two new ones that I just got, that I finally got, guys, and this is, um, Strawberry Sherbert. Oh, smells so good. Strawberry, Strawberry Sherbert. And then this is, I forget, let me smell. I think it's berries or something. I forget the other, I forget what this one's called. But, um, now I have all of them. And I'm so happy and they're so cute. Look at them. Look at them just sitting there. They're just absolutely adorable. Um, but yeah, they're all of my uh, favorites, and I'm definitely going to be making a video soon, guys, really. Um, after this one, I'm just going to keep going all night, so uh, yeah, bear with me. So um, if you have any questions, comments, please let me know. Don't forget to subscribe, check out my other videos, like my other videos, and I'm going to say it again, most importantly, don't forget to subscribe. But um, until next time, guys.